What's up guys? Now I was playing around with this gauntlet here and I found some hidden finger combinations with hidden sounds. Now if you guys haven't seen the review of this Marvel Legends Nano Gauntlet, you can check that out by tapping right up here. Now for those of you who have, you'll remember that closing and holding the fist makes a snap sound. And of course, moving the fingers makes a little robotic sounds. Now I found four additional finger combinations, each with their own sound, some of which are pretty wicked, so let's go and hear them. All right, now the first one is the rock on, as I call it, because you just put your hand in the rock on symbol. And it makes that sound. It sounds kind of like a movie intro or something. It's kind of weird, hear that again. So yeah, that's, that's, that's kind of interesting. And then the next one is the finger point. You just put your hand in the point. And it makes that sound. It totally sounds like a Transformers, like Bumblebee especially. Like, check this out. Hear it again. <laughs> that sounds pretty crazy. Michael Bay is probably pissed. But hey, you know, it also sounds like a failed snap because when you actually do it right... Hear that? That's the snap sound from the end of the movie of Endgame where Iron Man does a snap. Hear it again. <laughs> so you can actually snap with this gauntlet now. I mean, you can't really actually put the fingers together and, you know, do the snap thing, but hey, at least you can make the sound. You know what I mean? It, it's close enough. Yeah, boy. Oh, man. I don't know how many people I just did. I, I hope everyone's still there. Yeah. Hopefully. All right, and for the final sound, it's a real kicker. Here, check this out. It's a Spider-Man pose, but listen closely. Do you guys hear that? There's a voice in there. Here, I'll do it again. Spider-Man pose. Right there. I can't tell what that voice is. It sounds like it might be Iron Man. I don't, I don't even know what he's saying here. Let me put it right up to the mic. Let me adjust that so you can hear it clearly. All right, here we go, right up to the mic. Yeah, I have no idea what that voice is or who's saying or what they're even saying. So if you guys can figure out, definitely comment below because it's really bugging me. And before you guys ask, because I know you will, no, the middle finger doesn't make any sound. There, it just makes an error noise. There, okay, done, done. Now the Mind Stone doesn't make any new sounds, it's just still that one sound, this one. Just the power-up sound. But I did notice now that it actually, the lights have a breathing effect. Here, let me turn the lights off. Okay, there we go. Now it's kind of hard to see on camera, but I'm gonna put my hand here and reflect the light off my hand and you can see it a lot easier. Just check that out. See that, it's dim and now it's bright. It's dim, oh, it kind of flickered there. Now it's dim, bright, and it does it with all the stones, even the time stone here. Check this out, dim and then bright. So that's actually pretty cool. I didn't realize it did that before. So that's a pretty nice touch. All right, there we go, lights back on. Now you actually have an option to have these lights on where it doesn't do that breathing effect, where it doesn't pulsate, but first you have to make sure that it's off. You just push and hold just like before to turn it off. And then this time, instead of just you know activating the fingers or pushing the button, you push and hold instead of just pushing quickly. It powers up and now it'll do the constant on without the breathing effect. So in case, and the lights are on now, but in case you wanted a constant on, non-breathing effect, that's an option, but I think the breathing effect's cool, so I'm not using this effect. Well dudes, I just wanted to share that discovery with you because I think it's really cool and just made this gauntlet that much better. Now if any of you guys can make out what the voice is saying in the spidey hand pose, then please do comment below because like I said, I can't make it out and it's bugging me. Oh, and a remake of The Legends Rescue with voiceover is in the pipeline. I heard you guys loud and clear, so I won't be doing another speechless video anytime soon, or ever really. So you can expect that a few videos from now. Anywho dudes, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.